Yeah, wow, it was the 51 took a long time for me. Um, actually, I'd say Haley came in the right time because before, like, the Philippine Women's National Team would only get one tournament a year, and that's why it was going so slow. But when when she entered, we started getting more than one tournament a year. But um, the journey for me has been, I would say, amazing, unique, just because I saw the team from really at its lowest and trying to build up to where we are right now. And I've seen many people come and go as well, and you know they're all part of this whole journey, this whole um, victory, I would say, and it's nice receiving messages from my former teammates, and I always respond to them by saying, you know, you're also a part of this one, this is for you, you've worked hard for this, please celebrate with us, because it's, for me, I learned so much from them. Winning comes with expectations, and we've always considered ourselves underdogs, so we always play our absolute hearts out, and we can't we can't go into a game having expectations, regardless of where we stand on a worldly level or what have you. Um, I would say now, it, winning consistent it feels good. Like having that consistency of winning feels really good. But it's also it's also a little tricky because yes, of course you want to keep winning, but it just I feel like it'll just get harder. go for it. I mean, you will you will learn. The more you try and the more you may put yourself in, first off, like vulnerable situations, something you're not good at, the more you'll grow. You know, let's keep football alive. You know, do do the little things if it makes you happy, you know, if you want to try new things, if it's football or anything else, just do it. Just like what Haley said, if you're in an uncomfortable position, that's where growth happens the most. I would love to see the Philippines win the World Cup yeah. and the SEA Games. And the sea games for us our goals are definitely bigger picture uh, that we're we're going to the world cup for the first time so who knows what will happen and we will just want to we just want to compete and do our best and but i guess it's it's just another like foundation block for um women's football here in the philippines